the evolution of the Global Connected Aircraft Summit, it's been really exciting to see the shift from focusing just on operations to including so much more about the customer experience and how those two worlds can converge. I'm excited that we continue to talk about things like cybersecurity and artificial intelligence, and I'm really looking forward to as this pro program continues to grow. I think the Global Connected Aircraft Summit differs from a lot of other events because there is such a focus on so many different aspects of this industry. It can be so easy to just think about content or to just think about the passenger experience or just to think about operations. And I think it's a really great opportunity to bring all those different teams together and it really sets it apart from the other organizations in the industry. My favorite aspect of Global Connected Aircraft Summit has to be all the opportunities we have to learn. It becomes less about the exhibits, you still get the opportunity to interact with the different vendors in this space, but the focus really being on education is really helpful for me as an airline. I think some of the key learnings that we've had so far from Global Connected Aircraft Summit this year has just been the reminder that a lot of the airlines are in the same space. We're asking for the same things of the satellite operators and the service providers, and they're hearing that and they're trying to deliver on those needs. So it's a good reminder that we're all in this together. I think the Global Connected Aircraft Summit reminds us that we are at a point where it's about more than just bandwidth. We have to be able to deliver a consistent experience for not only our typical passengers, but for our crew as well. And so being able to focus on that and not just focus about, think about bursts and bandwidth and moments in time, but how to provide an ongoing experience to let customers meet those needs. I think when it comes to connectivity, you can't focus on just one aspect of it. It has to be a mix of delivering right amount of bandwidth to each of the customers, of being able to provide them a consistent experience throughout their flight so that they have the same experience early in the flight as at the end, um, and just being able to provide a well-rounded experience as opposed to just focusing on one element. Customer expectations is a fun one to try to manage because ultimately, the progress that's being made on the ground is very different than what happens in the air. And so trying to continue to stress to customers that they are in a metal tube moving 500 miles per hour, tens of thousands of feet in the sky, you definitely don't want it to come across as an excuse, but to provide them with the information they need to make sure that they know what to expect before getting on board. Global Connected Aircraft Summit being in Denver in 2020 is going to be a great way to bring more and more folks together and bring more airlines into the space, bring more service providers into the space, and just to check out the new content because we all know this space continues to evolve year after year.